Hi there, Janesh. Very happy to see that you've written an essay for us. Let's take a look straight away and uh, see what you wrote. Okay, the topic is international marketing. So let's see what you had to say. Okay, uh, promoting at international level could spread very quickly and sometimes it may put nation in unwanted situation. Some people believe that international marketing is required and provides knowledge at low cost. In my opinion, spreading your unique proposals, language, and culture through international marketing is very helpful to the nation. Okay. Um, well, the first sentence was um, a little problematic. There were some errors, so let's talk about what those problems were. Promoting, promoting what? Promoting product? Promoting, how about promotion in general? Okay, at the international level could spread very quickly. And sometimes it may put a nation in an in we in an unwanted situation okay um well that's it fixed grammatically it's still a little vague um but okay we can work with it like that um now here however since here you should have had some sort of contrast so you should have said however some people believe that international marketing is required etc etc uh and then i don't know about this your here so how about a country's so in my opinion spreading a country's unique proposals language and culture through international marketing is very helpful to the nation okay but then the question becomes which nation the nation doing the promoting or the nation receiving the promotion so it's a little vague you can see there's some problems with this introduction not so clear all right let's move on there are nations you didn't need to put a comma here so there are nations which are developing consistently due to uh, implementation of unique ideas in their system whereas some countries are way behind to catch up with them as continual improvement is the key to developing ing consistently nations plural should share their ideas at the international level to gain feedback and implement them in the best manner possible for instance european countries are implementing the zero emission policies by giving government subsidies to purchase electric vehicles if they put this type of scenario on the world platform all the nations plural could be benefited from it can be benefited from it which will improve the human health as well as save the conventional resources for our generations all right um this isn't really the most relevant example um that's not what international marketing is about uh that's not what they've asked you to talk about the thing is there's two facets here to consider one is that all this international marketing is invasive it's intrusive you're you know you're kind of barging into our culture why we don't like that and then the other side is is you know this is great it's informative it's in, it's educational we learn about language culture ideas it's fantastic so but i don't really know how this zero emission policy idea is relevant to either of those facets okay so i'm a little concerned about the way you chose to develop this okay Promotion is not just about sharing good thoughts. You can even gain knowledge of different tradition, food varieties, and natural attractions. Actually, it is a bilateral process. I have no idea why you decided to put that in its own paragraph. It should belong to one of your paragraphs, all right? International promotion, that always gives, there's no reason for a comma there. International promotion not always gives you positive feedback, but sometimes it may put the country into uh, an unwanted situation. For which they no, I may put the country into an unwanted situation which they do not want. Essentially, I think that's what you're trying to say. China, for example, China manufactures and exports with an S all the different kinds plural of products worldwide. Due to that, pollution has reached to the extreme level in some of the zone of the China. Now, pollution has reached in some zones of China. An extreme level which is or wait it has reached an extreme level in some of China's zones that's what you want to say 
which is affecting my residents badly. Okay, that's not what the essay is asking. Um, this example is not supporting um, the topic, okay? Um, so what I want you to do, Janesh, is I want you to read a little online or wherever you choose uh, about international marketing. See what it is. I feel like you've really misunderstood the topic here. Um, there are some problems with your grammar, especially in terms of the articles. There's a lot of missing articles, a lot of misplaced articles like a uh, and an and the. So uh, first of all, okay, there's a problem with the task response. You didn't understand the topic. Uh, the second problem is your paragraphing. This did not belong. It's a paragraphing. It's an illogical paragraph, and so that would affect your coherence and cohesion score. Grammatically, there are a lot of problems, like I said, with the... Um, the articles, there were some other problems as well. Um, vocabulary is is fine. So I think that if you are able to and decide to work with us, we could definitely help you um, in all of the areas that I just mentioned. So I hope that you'll look into that, see which option suits you best, and that we'll see more of your essays, okay? Uh, thanks for sending your essay in and wish you lots of luck with your IELTS preparation.